All right, this morning in Mongo, we're going to learn how to add to fields. And let's look at our collection here, Habs. Now, in Habs, we have a couple of fields. And one thing I want to note, we're going to, when we use the add operator, we got to be numbers, okay? You can't add two strings. You can catenate strings. You would not add strings. So what I would like to do is I'd like to return a document that has the days of failure plus the days of success. You can definitely tell the Western culture influence here, the days of learning and the days of success. Anyway, um, so we'd like to add those up. And we can do that, and we can use the project oper operator to do that. So let's go ahead and let's look at uh, doing this. Now in this case what I want to do is I actually want to look at some of the fields. I don't want to just add them up and produce output. But I don't want to look at the ID field, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to skip the ID field, okay? But I would actually like to look at, let's say, let's look at the creation date. So let's look at that. When we return this. And let's go ahead, let's go ahead and look at the, the days of success. So days of success. And then of course, Western culture here, days of failure for learning. And then finally, we can actually do our add operator after we first of all name the column. So what I want to do is I'm going to call this total days. And then we are going to do a colon here and we're going to throw out our add operator. So there's the add operator and it's basically an array. So it's an array of values. So one of the items in the array obviously is going to be days of success, right? And then the next item in the array is going to be days of failure. Okay, and we're going to close that out, close that and that there, and we will call it. Okay, and you'll notice that with the ID at zero, it does not come back, which is good. We didn't really want to look at the ID in this case. And we can see we have our days of failure, days of success, and total days. Okay, and you'll notice uh, that what it did here is it added on the total days, it added the days of failure and the days of success. Okay, so 27, well, those are all of zero. Um, but you can see this one's like 134 because it's 133 plus 1, and 15 plus 154 is 169, and so on and so forth. So yes, it is uh, possible to add uh, two fields in Mongo. Uh, for whatever reason, one of my uh, friends, I'm going to send him this video, but he was told by a colleague that he couldn't do that, and I was like, you can do that. So. Um, it is possible to do, and as you can see, you will use the project um, operator. And uh, in most of these cases, not always, but in some of these cases, I think people will usually say that they want to actually, it's the reason why I use the example of returning some of the other fields, usually that's what people want to see. They don't want to just see it added up. They're like, hey, wait, 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 which one are we talking about here? So I totally understand that.